today I'm going to be uh, starting the Firebird for the first time in like months just because it hasn't ran I'm got the battery charger on it right this second but I ordered some stuff for Old Blue has not came so I ordered a different style uh, slave cylinder because the setup that's on it didn't have enough throw to fully disengage the clutch it had a clutch fork and an externally mounted uh, slave cylinder it just didn't have enough throw, so I bought a slave cylinder from a slightly newer pickup, which means I'm going to have to remove the transmission again. There she is, covered in a couple months worth of fucking dust and dirt and fucking cobwebs. They've been working the fields around my house, so everything's just covered in dirt. Got the ancient ass battery charger on it. It's been on it for half an hour or so, so it might have enough power to crank over. I don't know how easy it's going to start, because through the carb sight window... I don't see any fuel, so it might have to crank a few times because this is a mechanical pump on this. But yeah, I think uh, tomorrow I'm going to, since I can't work on the truck, I'm actually going to uh, pull the transmission out of this and see how bad that thing is because I cracked the case on the Turbo 350 when the drive shaft decided to come apart at 100 plus miles an hour. That was interesting. And uh, take that out, uh, mock up. I have a Turbo 400 uh, that's probably a core, but the guy says it works. Mock that up so I can, uh, I need to change the cross number slightly and uh, measure for a drive shaft and all that. Let's see how this goes. This thing's got freaking wasp nests all over it. I killed a big huge one earlier that was inside the gas door that was the size of the freaking gas door. Well, the key makes noise. Need to set the charger on it longer, I guess. See if I can't give this thing a little uh, help. Because it still doesn't even have fuel in the carb yet. <clears throat> Even nicer. I don't even have the keys in the car. Alright. It appears we have a little bit of fuel. So I should be able to just pump the accelerator pump a couple times. Turn the key. And she should fire. God damn, got be, got be quicker than that. So I'm gonna give it a little more idle. Uh, I pulled. The distributor back a little bit took some timing out because and my cam videos i've had multiple people say that uh got too much timing in it and it does bump the starter a little bit but i've never heard it ping so anyways i pulled the timing back a little bit and now it's not one to idle so i'm gonna give it a little more idle and then uh here in a couple minutes try to start it again because i just ran the battery pretty much dead again
thing. Well, that's going to be it for this uh, little video. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. See you.